What's up everybody, welcome to my channel if you're new, welcome back if you're not. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do the Halloween event in New World Eternal. Okay, first things first, in order to start this quest, you're going to head to any settlement in the game. Next, you're going to open your map and look for this icon on the map. It's going to look like a pumpkin. When you're there, you're going to talk to this guy and accept the quest. Once you've accepted the quest, you can just exit out of the dialogue from this guy, and we're going to have to head over to the Belfazoo location. He's either going to be in Brightwood, Weaver's Fen, Morningdale, or Ebonscale Reach. The icon is going to look like this, and you can tell it's active or not if it has rings around it. If you see rings going around the icon, then you know people are there doing it, and if it just looks like it's plain and nothing's going on, then no one's there doing it. When you show up to the event location, you have to go around and kill a certain amount of pumpkin knights in order to spawn Bale. Once Bale ends up spawning, you can kill more pumpkin knights and toss the pumpkin head at Bale in order to lower his stamina bar. When Bale's bar has been depleted, then he'll take a knee and your damage will go up so much. Once you've killed Bale, he's going to drop some ichor, a piece of gear, and a costume. Once you have the ichor, you're going to head back to any settlement and go back to that pumpkin icon that we went to earlier to get the quest. For this, you can just use your recall to in or just teleport back to your house. Once you're back at the quest giver, you're going to walk up to the cauldron now that you have the ichor and you're going to use the ichor on the cauldron. This is going to give you some tokens for the event and a chest as well. Now we can finally go and talk to the quest giver and hand in our quest. He's going to give us some event reputation, some territory standing, some money, and another chest. When you open up the chest that the quest giver gave you, you're going to get some blueprints and tokens inside. And when you open up the chest from the cauldron that you put your ichor in, you're going to get some diamond gypsum, you're going to get the cauldron coins, and you're going to get some tokens. You're going to be using the tokens in the shop. You can access the shop by talking to the quest giver. Something that's really nice for new or returning players are the 700 gear score legendary pattern. These are guaranteed. 700 gear score items and that's major for anyone who's trying to get really easy gear score everything else is pretty much cosmetic but i would highly recommend grabbing the chromatic seal this is like a five thousand dollar item that you're getting for literal nothing now for the costume it's not just for a cosmetic you're actually going to need to equip this so you can grab the trick or treat throughout the settlement and that's pretty much it guys for the event you can pretty much just go and kill bale over and over again for more ichor feed it to the cauldron and just buy whatever you want. All right, guys, if this video helped you, make sure to leave a like, comment with how it did, and subscribe to the channel if you want more content like this in the future. I'm Audi. Pa -pa -pa. Peace.